Hi everyone, hope all is well. Today I'm going to cover the benefits of having all white control points and how you can easily make and keep this map for easy control point farming, for loot, XP and for blueprints. To create an all white map, select a character which is not your main, something that you don't really play on very often. Just set the world tier to um, normal, run around and clear control points, remembering not to fire the flare. Um, as you clear the control point, you'll notice that um, the flag will go white. As long as you don't fire the flare, the allies won't come and you won't capture it. One hour later. Now, after I've cleared all the control points, which took me roughly an hour, what you want to do then is obviously change these to the difficulty that you want to play at. The key here is not to change the difficulty on this particular map. If you do this, you will lose all your control points because it will reset them. The main trick is to travel off-site, so I picked um, Camp White Oak as it's a completely different map. Once I got there, then I changed the difficulty, add my directives, wait for the timer to complete so you know that the world difficulty has changed, travel back to DC, hit your map, and then you'll see that all the control points have now changed back to level 3 in this case. So, nice and easy, that's how you create a map. Okay, so to use this map effectively, the character who owns the map does not want to use the map. So ask a friend to join you, um, so that friend can hold the map, log out, log back in as a different character. When you log back in, join your friend who's holding your map. You'll see that um, we're now on the all white map. Your friend can now leave if they wish, or they can hang around with you. In this instance, I've came over to Navy Plaza, uh, the control point everyone likes to do. Uh, there's only two um, manholes here, where they spawn from on the uh, defend phase. Very, very easy just to spawn camp the manholes. And you can see how quickly it is to wipe out the NPCs. It takes roughly about 30 seconds. The longest time you spend here is actually waiting for the allies to turn up and to fully capture and turn the control point green. Using an all white control point map in this way is a super fast and quick efficient way of gaining XP and loot and blueprints if you don't only have them from CP3s and CP4s. Just cuts out that entire time of actually having to um, go through both phases. So there we have it. That's how we create and use an all white control point map. Just remember, don't use um, your white map character to farm these control points. Um, get someone else to hold that while you switch to a different character. And don't change the world difficulty on this map. Travel off site to do it. Or if you do that, you will lose all those control points and lose all your hard work. And have to spend another hour setting it back up again. So hey, that's it from me. Bye bye now.